Not too much for me to do tonight, so I'm sitting this one down, but not out. Welcome to the final wager. I'm Keith Williams, and I only have one player to deal with tonight. Tracy at the Champs Podium, negative 1,600. She's out. Eric has it locked up, 17-8. Mary Lou in second, 6,800. Not historically a great score for a wild card. Put it in the 40th percentile of not winning scores all time. If she thinks there's a coin flip or better chance that she'll get this one right, she should just wager pretty much everything. I have it at 5,700 at 50%. Uh, this is all the calculator that I built for this purpose, which I'll share more about next Monday. If she doesn't think she has a chance of getting it, if she's less than 50% to maximize expected value, she might as well just wager zero. But state flags is one of those categories you can usually get at from some other angle. She wagered 3,800, got it wrong. Still in third place behind uh, Aaron from Monday's game and Kathy from last night. When I talk about getting it from another angle, the reason I got this one, well, the first thing that led me to it is a little bit of hockey knowledge. The Dallas Stars used to play in Minnesota, where they were known as the North Stars. You probably know the Alaskan flag has the Big Dipper on it at the very least. It also has Polaris, the North Star, so put two and two together. Both of them have North Star in common. That's enough for me. Well, it wasn't enough last night with algebra. Uh, yeah. We'll have six semifinalists tomorrow. We'll have the four winners, and uh, two wild cards will have clinched their positions. Aaron's looking in great shape. And we'll see how our three other players fare with four other potential semifinalists, non winners, waiting in the wings. I might be sitting down tomorrow, too. I'll be heading home to Vermont. Uh, looking forward to that. Maybe I'll have a dog on my lap, or two, or three. Find out with me then, Thursday, on the final wager.